if you haven't seen it before, this is the AI Copywriting Creators website. And as you can see, we've got a huge number of tools on here that you can check out. Some of these you won't have heard of before. You can see our videos, but we also have up here our newsletter where you can get coupon codes, discounts on some of the software. But you will notice that a lot of websites have a newsletter and that's because it's an amazing way for you to make some money. And you don't actually have to have a website in order to produce a newsletter and make money from it. There's software out there that you can use that will now allow you to set up a newsletter, send the newsletter out to people that get it in their inbox to be able to track metrics and you don't even have to have any knowledge of SEO or have a website. But if you are gonna do that, then you're going to need to write some copy for it. You're gonna to have to write the newsletter. And the tool I wanna show you today is Hoppy Copy. Hoppy Copy is amazing at writing newsletters. Within a few clicks, you can get a newsletter written for you, targeted to your niche, around your brand, in your brand tone, with relevant images. And you can then just cut and paste that into whatever provider you're using to send out your newsletter. So it gets emailed out to your audience. And as I said, you don't need to have any knowledge of SEO to do that. You don't need to have a website. You can just host it on a newsletter software. If you want us to tell you more about those kind of softwares, then just go down to the comments and put the word software. And if we get enough interest, we will make that video for you. But for now, I want to show you exactly how Hoppy Copy works, how you can use it to build out your newsletter, whether you have a blog or whether you just want to build a newsletter and monetize that. The way you're going to monetize it, well, you're going to talk to uh, brands and get sponsorship deals so that they pay to be featured in your newsletter. I'll show you the pricing in a bit so you can see how crazy this is in terms of value for money. But when you come into Hoppy Copy, you can get a free trial. Just use the first link in the description. You'll be able to get a seven day free trial. This is what the dashboard's gonna look like. You can see we can build stuff for the website, social media posts, email campaigns, but it's the newsletter that we're interested in. So just clicking here, you can see there's tons and tons of things we can do within the newsletter, but it's the newsletter creator here that I wanna show you today. It really is crazy fast. Now we've got two options at the top. We've got multi-section and that's for where you want to do an email that has several sections to it. So an introduction, maybe then you do a deep dive on a particular piece of software or a particular brand. That's where your sponsorship would come in. Case studies, maybe uh, interview, Q&A, FAQ, all those kind of things. Single story is where you want more of a deep dive. So you've just got one focus for your newsletter and you're going in depth around that particular thing. So you're going to put in the details. So we've got the from, who is uh, the newsletter from, the target audience, who are we trying to talk to and connect with, and then the topics of interest. So that's what you want the newsletter to focus on. So I've already picked this information out. So I'm doing it for AI copywriting creators. So this will be the next newsletter that we send out. And as I said, this will be link in the description. If you want to sign up, you get a few coupon codes for copywriting software when you sign up in the first couple of emails, and then you get help and support and suggestions of software that you can use in order to create copy, AI images, all that kind of thing. You can see here I'm using uh, AI tools such as ChatGPT to write blog posts. That's the topic for this particular uh, newsletter. And then we're going to click tone. Now, the nice thing about this is you can create your own custom brand tone. So if you're going to use this across your websites, you're going to use um, Hoppy Copy for your social media posts and for your newsletter, then I def definitely recommend you do this. What we're going to do now is I'm just going to go for a casual tone. Um, we're going to include images. The newsletter creator in Hoppy Copy will put relevant images in for you. And if you don't like them, you can swap them out. And then we've got two options here, speed or depth. Now speed is fine when we're doing multi-section. I quite like depth when we're going for single story. Once we've got all that filled out, we just hit create and it's gonna go ahead and it's gonna create the first part of our newsletter. And you can see how quickly this is working. Now you can do this in ChatGPT, but you're gonna to have to train ChatGPT how to do this. You're gonna tell it, have to tell it about the sections that you want, how you want it to write, your brand's tone. You're gonna to have to learn some prompt engineering. You're gonna to have to go through and make some mistakes before ChatGPT does what you want it to do. Hoppy Copy is gonna jump a lot of that headache for you because what it does, it's already been trained on the AI. Plus, obviously, you do have to pay for Hoppy Copy. Yes, you have to pay for ChatGPT if you want it above the 3.5, but I was able to do all of this without having to know any prompt engineering. Not only that, but it tells me here what's going to happen. So this is the first section of my 
newsletter. It's going to start off talking about the latest AI copywriting news and it's going to tell me exactly what it's going to do. So it's going to share the latest news, provide some insights and then include some updates. If I don't like any of these prompts, I can change them. I can uh, delete them. I can move them around. All of this I can edit. So I can just go through these. You can see I've got 10 sections here. I'm probably not going to use all of them, but you can see the kind of things that it's producing. Tips, best practices, Q and A's and FAQs, trends, insights, community spotlight, loads and loads of different ideas. So what we can do is we can go through and we can get the AI to write each of these sections for us. So I could just go through one at a time, editing these prompts and then getting it to write. Or if I like everything, or I just want to see what it produces, then I can hit write all. I can also as well move these around so I can swap the order if I don't like the order that they're produced in and I can delete them um, as well if I want to get rid of them. Um, I can also add sections as well if I want it to keep going. We can also start over from the beginning if I don't like any of it. But let's just hit write all for now. And what it's going to do is it's going to go through and it's now taking those prompts that I've had the opportunity to edit and it is going to write every single section of this for me. And as you can see, it's going to go through and it's going to pick images out. So I've got all of this information now written for my newsletter. And not only that, if I don't like a particular image, I can just hit the button here. It will regenerate and it will produce another image for me. If I still don't like it, then I can go down here. I can change the prompt. Um, so I can change it to maybe uh, working at a desk and then it will go away. It will take that and it will regenerate. So, um, photo of a person working from a desk it will go through and it will change that for me so I've got a better image so I can go through I can change any of this text I can change any of these images I can still delete sections if I want if I don't like any of this then I can regenerate and I can just go through and I can check the all of this out and then what I can do is I can just start adding these to my newsletter. So this section over here is where I'm going to build my newsletter. So we go up to the top here. I like all of this. I don't want to make any changes. I'm going to insert it into my document. That's the first part of my newsletter done. Then we're going to go with tips and techniques. I like that one. So that's in there as well with my regenerated image. Then I can also start to insert links. If I like this one here and I want to write a little bit more, then I can just highlight it and I can expand and it will go away the AI and it will write more on that particular paragraph for me. You can see as well, I can also do some editing so I can make it bold, italic, I can underline it. I can make whatever changes that I need to make within the editor in order to be able to um, improve this. And you can see it's working there to expand the information. So I've got a lot more in there and I can go through and I can change any of these. So I accidentally did it twice there, didn't I? So I can just get rid of those ones there. So I've now expanded on all of that and I can just go through and format it. Then I can go down here. We'll add a few more sections. So let's add um, some tool reviews. Let's insert that one. Let's then go down to uh, Q and A's. Let's say I don't like that bit, so it's going to regenerate it for me. It's going to rewrite that Q and A. Quite like that now. Don't like that particular picture. So again, I can just regenerate that picture. And this is all you're going to do. You're just going to go through changing these particular um, sections. And let's put uh, the. Let's go down and put the last section in. So we'll do community spotlight. I'm going to put in the last section as well, which is normally the di uh, conclusion. Or we've got here the uh, offers and discounts, which is a great place for me to put in my affiliate links. And now, as you can see, I've got a newsletter that's got all the information in it that I wanted to uh, include. It's got all of those different sections that I wanted to have in it. And now all I need to do is I need to go away and cut and paste this into my newsletter tool whichever one that I'm going to use. And as I said, just comment below and we'll make a video on that. And then I can send this out, but you can see how quickly I was able to produce a newsletter that's fully formatted with images, with all this relevant information that I can edit. I can change any of these images, give it better prompts, adapt everything so that it fits my brand, my audience in order to be able to give them as much help as possible. So as I said, 
go down to the description if you want to check out Hoffy Coffee. For pricing, for those of you that want to know about that, it's $23 a month for starter, but you can see they've got the seven day free trial here. You've got Pro and you've got Pro Plus. You've got 20,000 words generated per month, which you can put towards your newsletter. And also, if you're interested in going in a little bit more detail with your writing and you're interested in SEO, they do actually allow you to monitor 10 competitors as well. But you can start off by looking at the free trial for seven days using that link in the description and accessing that. If you want to know more about writing for a website or a blog and using different tools to do that, then check out this video on the screen now. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next one.